Canopy MLS members. Thank you for joining me today to review the safety features Canopy MLS offers through the Supra eKey app and the Showing Time app. First, let's review the Supra eKey app alert feature. The Supra alert feature is located at the bottom left of your Supra eKey app. To activate this function, you must register and log in with SuperWeb. SuperWeb is your laptop or desktop version of your Super account. You only need to register the first time you use this feature. Once you activate and enable the alert feature, all you have to do is update your Super E key and it will be ready when you need it. Let's take a look now. The first thing you'll want to do is log into SuperWeb by going to www.suprasystems.com. Once you land on this page, you'll select SuperWeb for Agents. You'll get the option to register or log in. The very first time that you use SuperWeb, you'll want to register. Fill out the basic information, select your username, and once you select your username, click on the check rectangle to ensure that you have not selected a username that is used by anyone else in the nation. You'll select your password. If you hover over the information bubble, you'll get the parameters. This password does begin with a letter. And also if you use a symbol in your passwords, this system only recognizes the period the hyphen, the underscore, and the at symbol. You'll select your challenge questions, enter that code, and select submit. Once you submit, and the very first time that you log into your SuperWeb account, you'll need your eKey serial number, which is located at the very top of your app. It'll say welcome to the eKey app, and your eKey serial number will be there. You'll add the PIN number that you selected when you started using the Super eKey, and then you'll select your association or your MLS. Super identifies Canopy MLS as Carolina MLS DBA Canopy MLS, and this will be nested under NC for North Carolina. So let's go ahead and get logged in. Once you're logged into SuperWeb, look under the Quick Links heading here and select eKey Alerts. You'll enable the service, and then you'll add your contact information for your safety buddy. So you can choose to use an email, or you can use a cell phone number. If you're using the cell phone number, select the suffix that correlates with that person's cell provider. You can choose up to three contacts to add to this feature and then type in your note. I've added that this is just a test and then select save. Be sure to communicate with your safety buddy that you've added them to this feature and test it out a few times. So that way you know it'll work when you need it to work. So now that you've logged into SuperWeb and you've enabled your alert feature, Log into your app and select the update button. You'll see that it's updating here. As soon as your app has been updated, you're ready to use the alert feature. Again, I would recommend practicing with your safety buddy before you need it. You will place your thumb or finger over the alert feature. It will buzz underneath your finger and it'll change to scent. This system has now sent a message over to my safety buddy, and the message that I indicated on the SuperWeb account will go to their inbox, whether it's via text or email. Now I've logged into the Showing Time app. The safety feature is called Showing Beacon. Anytime you have a showing, it is a great feature to use to ensure your safety. All you have to do is select Start Showing Beacon, add your safety buddy's information here at the top, select the amount of time that you need, and then select Start Showing Beacon. If you need a little bit more time during your showing, you can add a few minutes by clicking on that plus five minutes Maybe you need 10 more minutes. So you'll add your time by clicking on that button. 
If you need to send an emergency showing time beacon to your safety buddy right away, all you have to do is click on this bar here for three seconds. Once the bar turns orange, a message has been sent straight over to your safety buddy and they should be getting in touch with you right away. After you've finished your showing, be sure to go back into the showing beacon and end your timer. That way you won't inadvertently send a message over to your safety buddy stating that you need some help. Thank you for joining me today to learn how to use the super alert feature and also the showing time beacon. It's a great idea to communicate with your safety buddy in advance and practice these features before you need them. If you need more tips for being safe, log into the National Association of Realtors safety site by going to nar.realtor forward slash safety forward slash realtor dash safety dash tips dash from dash nar. Thanks again for joining me. And if you have more questions, please email bbouvier at canopyrealtors.com or call or text 828-318-8888.